All aboard for the Mad City Model Railroad Show and Sale. It's coming up this weekend, and here to tell us more about it, we have Paul Mangan and also Mike Vivian. Good morning to both morning. of you. Good morning, Amy. How are you doing? I'm doing great, thank you. Now, you've had this a number of years at the Alliance Center, oh, yeah. but um, tell us about some of the changes you started last year, Paul. Yeah, we had some changes last year where we used to be spread out throughout the entire building, mm -hmm. and uh, a lot of people missed things you couldn't see if you weren't out looking for it or know it was there. Sure. So now we're in one humongous room. Okay. <laughs> we, we've you've got everybody in there now, and the whole thing fits in there just wonderfully. Great. And you have a number of train layouts, too. Yes, we do. We have over 30 layouts. Wow. And we have 70-plus vendors okay. covering 300-plus tables. Oh, my goodness. So it, you do fill and, the space. Oh, yes. And we have 10... Uh, displays from museums mm -hmm. and also there's clinics going on all day long. Okay. Now Mike, tell us a little bit. Something we don't normally talk about mm -hmm. is the it's called Railroadiana, right? Rail Railroadiana. Uh, that's represented by some of the items here. Uh, it clothing from the period that were worn by uh, railroad personnel, uh -huh. lanterns used by them. Uh, it also includes things like artwork that people have produced of, uh, for example, this lo steam locomotive from the past. And also we have uh, railroad posters that people collect as well. And some of these, they're just exhibits for people to see uh, they are, some but of the things. We also have some people who vend these items. Okay. If, you're, if you're a collector, uh, it's a great opportunity maybe to pick up an item to add to your collection. Uh, but of course we have all the model trains of all the different sizes. So run through there all the different sizes. Let's start with the largest one. Paul? This is G-Scale. Uh-huh. Yeah, this type of uh, uh, model is run outside in the yard. Oh, okay. Yes, they are. I have that in my own yard. Yeah. And I have a lot of fun out there at night chasing little critters <laughs> around the yard and things like that. The cats like to watch it, too. These here are the smaller sizes. Uh, this is HO, uh -huh. which is one of the most popular sizes still going today. And these two over here are N-Scale. Mm -hmm. And all these you'll see on display at the show running on different layouts. This one they have running on the floor so the kids can sit around the outside and watch the trains. Oh, wonderful. And yeah. also, Paul, you're going to be giving away some train sets. Too. Oh, yes. This year, like previous years, we have eight train sets to give away. We have uh, four for Saturday and four for Sunday. And we also have a lot of other door prizes that have been donated by the various vendors that we'll be giving away every hour on the hour. So a great opportunity for some of these little engineers oh, yeah. to start oh, yes. developing a wonderful hobby. Yes, it is. All right. Well, it's the Mad City Model Railroad Show and Sale. It's yep. a mouthful, that's for sure. <laughs> it's all happening at the Alliant Energy Center at Exhibition Hall, the entire hall. And that will be Saturday and Sunday. Come on in. It's warm inside, yes, and uh, you'll spend all day watching things go round and round. Oh, yeah. It's our 48th show, so come on out and see it. All right. Thanks so much. Well, thank, thank you, you, Amy.